Hey there, everyone. It's me. And I don't know if there's one here, but there's been a lot of for the few who do. Anyways, hi. I know it's been a long time ever since I did anything on YouTube, but once again, Twitter. Plus, um, my exam days, my finals. Also, I'm gonna be finishing my finals at like this Wednesday. Also, but I'm not really sure what I will do when I'm done and everything. But I might be ditching this YouTube account for like a very good while because of, once again, Twitter roleplay. Although I did keep on saying that I will leave, uh, but I didn't. I just didn't, and I'm still going, I'm still getting people to follow, still like sometimes getting baited by most of the people who reply to me and all this kind of stuff. And I'm gonna be very honest. I'm gonna be very honest. Like it's um, it's a it's a fucking terrible time on there, really. And you know, once again, still quite demoralizing. And I'm just gonna give you all like a very short version of what I have seen in the last three days like there's basically that lore account you know and let me tell you they turned out to be the craziest and the stupidest ones I have ever encountered to the point where calling me problematic after like interacting and seeing what the hell they we're doing the past three days. My my God, it's it's crazy as hell. And I'm gonna be real with you. It kind of sucked also at times. Like um, yeah. So. Um, Basically, they made the, a very stupid take where they're like, if you're role playing as a fighting game character, but you're not fighting as much as a fighting game character, your portrayal sucks. And I'm not kidding. They actually said that. Well, what's worse is that 23 plus people have, including me, have been trying to tell them to stop and to just get that take, to get that take off the whole thing, you know. And the thing is, like, there are debates and arguments about it was like the worst, not to mention the jokes. And the amount of stupid replies that they are getting into. And using the word objectively, core aspect, straw manning. Uh, they even were hosting like five Twitter spaces. Like approximately five Twitter spaces on the span of those three days. I've even tried to tell them in DMs and in spaces and try to give them the simplest amount of arguments that, let's be real, lots of people agree on it. And they wouldn't budge and the same stupid responses and excuses have just came up. Until they were revealed doing some, you know, pedophilic shit and some weird stuff. And... I'm gonna be honest, I'm kinda glad. Some of you would be asking, 
How did you even meet up with them or even get them? There is that one trend called Women Crush Wednesday. And when doing that, so I tagged them on there and we followed each other. It was getting decent for a while until. Yeah. Nothing. Like, literally nothing. And besides, their portrayal of Laura was honestly not that good. But anyways, like, it was nuts as hell. Not to mention, there is this other, there was this other weird thing called, um, what was it called? Can't really remember. Uh, something about unearing sexual preferences or some shit. Like, um, can't really remember exactly, but basically it was another stupid debate that came up. And you guys have no idea how ridiculous most of this whole thing was. But really, aside of that, this is still just me getting blocked, uh, losing some people, losing some friends, not being able to maintain a serious roleplay on there, all this kind of stuff. And let me be honest here. Uh, I've just decided to stay just because of the few people wanted me to. Quite like two or one. But then again, I'm gonna have to leave that sooner or later. Even though it's too late because I've been on there during like the last few weeks of my finals and whatsoever. But yeah, like things haven't been that good because of Twitter honestly. So it's the reason why I've been disappeared off YouTube for this long. Although, I feel bad, I'm not gonna lie. I feel bad for just getting addicted to Twitter when my whole, like, purpose of making one in the first place was to just reach out to those old friends that still have Discord and all this kind of stuff. And then, well, before you know it, I've been losing a lot of people and losing myself. And eventually, lost myself into turning the account into another motherfucking roleplay account. And my god, <laughs> that's, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good at all. In fact, I may have gotten myself into a deeper rabbit hole. But am I thinking about leaving? Absolutely. It's been all in my head to just leave. You know, all what's in my head, leave Twitter now. Leave Twitter now. Leave Twitter now. Really? Like, how in the, because honestly, how in the hell Am I gonna try to bother on all of this? Oh well. I really hope that there isn't gonna be another drama or any shit that's gonna be directed towards me and I'm gonna cause another mental loss. Not to mention, I haven't been doing that good in my finals. But hopefully, I pass this one. Like really, and hopefully I get to pass this one with flying colors. So, yeah, so much is at stake. And this Wednesday is going to be quite the decider, you know. Like, that Wednesday, it's my final exam. At my finals. And hopefully... I get to be able to 
solve makeup solutions and whatsoever. And like I said, be able to pass, you know. But aside of all of the Twitter roleplay bullshit, and let me tell you, Twitter roleplay, no matter how hard you're trying to to do in it, if you are roleplaying as yourself in some kind of an OC, no matter how hard you try, you're just... Um, you're just not gonna get it, especially if you're me, really. Like, if you're a self-insert OC, yeah, just forget it, really, just forget it. Don't bother, you know, you either need to make a canon character or, um, or a female character, whichever you need, you know. Like, unless you're a female, or a canon character, then you're completely accepted. And, or one of those super highly efforted OCs that aren't self-inserted, but made up, and completely something, you know? And honestly, those types of OCs, I fucking hate them. And... Yeah, I fucking hate them, and I can't believe that they exist, because there's a reason why I'm getting fucked over in everything related to roleplay, you know, in ships, interactions, and all this kind of stuff. Like, my god, I was dreaming about the day where uh, some OC is announcing her ship partner with another one of those fucking super highly overrated OCs. Let me fucking tell you. It was a disaster as well. Really. Like, ugh. Once again, Twitter roleplay is the worst ever rabbit hole you would, you would want to fall into. Fuck. <laughs> Genuinely, Twitter roleplay is the last place you would want to ever be, you know? Like, it's a... It's a horrendous place on all fucking, like, beyond belief, you know? Like, it not only ruins your mental health, but it ruins your life as a whole in real life. Like, you just get terribly addicted to it, but... Then, at what's been happening, it just causes lots of negativity. Like, it's, uh, it's just terrible. It's, uh, it's ter- it's addictive on a terrible way as well. And it just puts you into, like, the deepest, worst downward spiral in your life as a whole. You know, it genuinely just ruined it. You know what I'm feeling? You know what I mean? And the worst thing though, we can't sometimes control it. Like, we just want to role play with almost anyone in everything. You would either want to roleplay with a fucking plant or a couch if that's what what's gonna happen. Really. Like... Like, honestly, life as a roleplayer on Twitter? Bullshit. A complete bullshit. The worst ever mistake. And... I can't believe I have stayed in there. And... Just hopefully one day I can just leave, really. Like it's beyond, it's beyond fun. It's beyond even just a hobby, and even to escape, and even the, and even when it's supposed to be the place that you are escaping to from reality, it escapes you. Like even that hobby escapes you. It's like, it's 
like the biggest what the fuck moment. You're supposed to be having fun, but you can't. You're supposed to be escaping to it, but you can't. You're supposed to be embracing it, but you can't. You just can't. Because people keep fucking you over. And for what? Being a self-insert OC and a male. But if you are a female at anything, believe me, you're going to succeed. You're terrible. You're going to just tell and terribly succeed. You know, people will just hear you out at all times. <laughs> I know it's kind of a ridiculous way to look at it, but I have been blocked by half. But I have been blocked by a lot of people. And they wouldn't even try to hear me out. So. It makes me right. But, however, like. I really hope this does not continue. I really hope this does not continue on a on this kind of a terrible pace, cause yeah, uh, sometimes sometimes I just don't even get it anymore. Like I just don't even get and understand. Why is it still this hard till now? And it's safe to say that I may have fucked up my life because of that, you know? Like I was doing very well until I decided to come back to, to it, you know? Big mistake, really big mistake. And, yeah, like, the only ship that I would ever get are literally two gay men, an Aaron from Mortal Kombat, and a Jojo OC. Like, I don't mind that, but is it really all I'm gonna get? Gay ships? Like... I don't mind at all, but is this really all what I'm gonna get? Cause if it's really all what I'm gonna get, then uh, no. I know I'm supposed to be pleased with what I have at times, but if this is really all what I'm gonna get, as far as I'm gonna get, then no way, man. Just no way. <sighs> yeah. What a shitload of fuck time, to be honest. And honestly, I really hope that things would just go on a better lane, you know? Hopefully, things would get better. And. My staying is worth it. Because like I said, it's demoralizing, it's a suffering more than anything. And yeah, I regret it very hard. Aside of all that, uh, like I said, I'm going to be finishing my gems in like three days. And I'm going to be having a decent time with most of my video games, especially the Street Fighter 6 demo, and a bunch of other games. And like I said, hopefully my, my results aren't going to be the same as the last two years. I'm gonna end this here, so see you all later.